coming up. Two of those. First up is Nick Wall against George Parker. On the clock for this first one. He's going to want to get some serious work into Wall. And he, he managed to do that against Rooney, who's just shy of the 20-minute mark, if I remember rightly. It was about 19 minutes. But he got the rewards because the next game he won at 11 love. <laughs> yeah. Furious pace, but not quite finding the target to the back. We've seen, well, it's been the trend over the last few days that it's proved very difficult to get the ball into the back corners on this court. Yeah, it's difficult to find the right pacing, the right height on the front wall. You've got to get the line, obviously. Well, oh, is yeah, I mean, to actually do it from a platform, whereas there's been a few times now where he's rattled it off and it's just handing Parker quick points. So he needs to get the balance. But I, I like the fact he's being inventive and he's trying different things. But he also has to settle. Well, he's obviously trying to get his tactics right. It's a very different opponent that he's up against today as opposed to yesterday. And just pace in itself won't have quite as much effect against a player like Parker. So he does need to be creative and proactive on there, but as you said, he has to get the balance right. That is great touch from Parker. Really strong in the lunge into the front corner. I'm not sure what he's done to himself, but that is a really good shot. Nice touch. round Down. Mm. Eleven, eight. the lift was the option for wall there front right Nice attack again from Wall. Oh. He's making Parker do some work in this rally. Clever shot. That is a really well constructed rally by Wall. Impressive from start to finish. Constructed rally where Parker had to do so much work. So it's almost a, a double reward for a rally like that. Parker didn't see that one at all. Six, one. Brilliant spell here from Wall. Three game balls still for Nick Wall. Could have easily taken the stroke, opting to play. Oh. 
Oh, what a shot. That is an outrageous game shot on the backhand. One game all. <laughs> He'll be very pleased with this. What a shot. Boyd. Caught him quite a few times with the angle. Real. Quite late reading it, Parker. Control the ball as he needed to with the bow. So really the best shot there was a defensive option. Well, again, he's done that twice now and he's trying to hit almost an attacking shot from a defensive position. There again, and it's starting to go a little bit wayward. It's always clues to look for, isn't it, in the opponent, if you can start to see the upper body Down. falling forward. Oh, he's going for it. Does Nick Wall realise it's his 10-9 game ball down here? <laughs> down. 12-10. What? Exactly, it's not an easy thing to do, is it? That's for sure. Again, pretty, pretty decent angle from that position One, wall, but two. it probably wasn't the right shot selection from that defensive position. I won't believe that. Eleven well closed eight. out by Nick Wall. Wall. Playing very well, Nick Wall. Had 60 minutes of full on squash here. Ah, oh, what a lob. Great lob from Wall. Big lead starting to open up. It's a bit of a let off because Parker wasn't really moving for it. Oh, what a recovery. And he's back up. Stroke. Can you believe that get and that recovery from Parker? Did so well to get to the back. Four, five. Yeah, he didn't read the straight ball initially. I mean, that was unbelievable, that get. Incredible. Right side. I mean, he'd raced from the front all the way to the back there. You yeah. said it wouldn't take much for a bit no. of an NG boost. Yeah, exactly. Just managed to edge ahead. Just a bit of extra experience as well, Just showing.
Very good touch again. Parker's touch when he's been in the front there Nine, at full six. stretch has been exquisite. He's been leaving the ball so short. I mean, to remember he was, what, 6-3 down in this game. Out. Well, and there Nine, it is. Six. Match to Parker. Brilliant match Three between two. these two. 11-8, 9-11, Well, all credit. I mean, eight, he's eight, hanging 11, his head. He's absolutely 11, gutted, six. Nick Wall Jr. But um, he should be very proud of that. And it, it shows the level he's now achieving, having beaten James Wallstrop yesterday. So close today. He, he will get to play again tomorrow in a playoff. And he's got another chance to prove himself again. But this match, this semi-final, George Parker is the victor. He's battled his way through in 70 minutes, winning 3-2. That fifth game, 13 minutes, 11-6. He came back and steamrolled his way through. George Parker's into the final. Nice finish. Fellows is going to keep trying his luck, asking for a let every time Nine James hits a winner. Right Wasn't sarcastic at all. That stroke closes out the first game for James. Thanks. He's done well here, fellows. Let's see if he can keep this consistency and hold it together for the whole of the game. That's the test, especially if James can get it, get it building again. I feel like it's been quite fragmented this second game, so there's not been any kind of work put into fellows. Yeah, it's up the pace a bit here, though. heard you Drew Boy want that. he's done well here fellows Let's see if he can keep this consistency and hold it together for the whole of the game that's the test especially if James can get it get it building again I feel like it's been quite fragmented this second game so there's not been any kind of work put into fellows yes yeah, up the pace a bit here though Heard you, Drew Boy. To you want that? be cleared better. 
It's a bit scrappy. Generally that happens when, when you miss your length. So as soon as you miss your targets and it's around that service box where it's landing now, that's where the, the, the problems happen. Oh, well played, Richie Fellows. That is very impressive. Good movement into the front right. And he stayed there with his nose pinned against the front wall and was able to volley volley. Six. Volley four. volley. <laughs> no let's. It's pretty seven. high, I would say, right now. <laughs> it's huge. Absolutely huge. Record. Yeah, I was going to say it could actually be record breaking percentage. Oh. Ten no, minutes this bounce. game. Eight. Some feel five. like it's been ten minutes of sort of really intense squash. Nice. Oh, he's got it. <laughs> the Dark Knight's in there still. 11-6. That is a great there. finish. Brilliant. Very good Two, on the forehand one. side here. Vanessa cuts in nicely. Nice finish from Fallows. A rare opportunity for him in this game. James has been very stingy. Still a game ball for Deck James, though. Oh, oh he's on the dive. He's got it twice. Oh, he's going to get the stroke. <laughs> oh, my word. How's he done that? <laughs> Two massive dives from James. That's the first, is it? No, that was the second. We need to see the one before. <laughs> Fallows tried to get I the know. ref to tell him off and then got his finger stuck in the door. <laughs> there was even another dive before that one. Third. Oh, what a shot. He's taking that ball in short very well when he's going for it. He's just taking it on slightly more now. The aggressive. Searching boast, really stretching out, James. Yeah, That's brilliant. very good. Hand out. Started with the boast and he just Four, kept three. on going at him gnawing away. That ball stayed on his racket for about 20 seconds there. That's a good shot. It's a bit of a trademark fellow's shot that on the forehand. Oop. Yeah, good, good tight shot yeah, and nicely great. followed up. Stop oh. dropping his racket. Possible to go and get that. Eight, five. That's a winning shot. That's good, yeah. Doesn't always do that actually Three. when he creates. Match ball. Five match balls for James. He's just tucked up on top of that. Well, Deck James coming through. 3-1. He put the foot on the accelerator there at the back end of that. Took the game completely away from Fallows, winning it. A 3-1 in 74 minutes.
And that final game, 11-5 in 10. So Deck James safely through to the final.